We continue our study with the Gospel of Matthew. We are looking in chapter 8, and we will be reading from verses 5 through 8a. I'm going to read from the New International Version. When Jesus entered Capernaum, a centurion came to him asking for help. Lord, he said, my servant lies at home paralyzed and in terrible suffering. Jesus said to him, I will go and heal him. The centurion replied, Lord, I do not deserve to have you come under my roof. In every era of the church, there is or are issues that are unique to that time and place. In the first and second generation of the church, so maybe about 30 to about 80 CE, there was the transition of the church from being a Jewish sect to a distinct faith. There was a transition from a Jewish entity to a largely Gentile entity. And one of the great barriers to this transition was the traditional Jewish apathy to the Gentiles. How do you create a universal church if one group despises another? Now you can know that this problem has always been in the Christian church, expressed in different ways, but always been there. In popular Jewish culture, eating with Gentiles was taboo. How do you celebrate communion if one group will not eat with the other? And you can go into Paul's letters and see where this was an issue. The early church had to work through these issues, and as usually happens in situations like this, things did not and would not go smoothly. When we read the story of the centurion coming to Jesus with a plea for help for his servant, this is done in the context of Gentile Jewish animosity. In the previous paragraph, I put the burden on the Christian Jews to incorporate Gentiles. The Jewish distaste for the Gentiles was met by the Gentiles' loathing for the Jews. In other words, the centurion was not simply coming to Jesus. It was not a case of doing a Google search for faith healers. It was an action that had risk attached to it. Why would Jesus want to come to the home of a Gentile? For the Gentiles were unclean people. If we look at the story from the larger context, then we see how desperate this man was. This man was willing to reach out to a despised people, and at the same time as a despised people reaching out to those that despised him. There was risk. In verse 7, we have one of the great truths of salvation expressed here. Salvation is possible because God crosses barriers. In simple terms, God does not remain in heaven. In Jesus, we have God incarnate, born in the manger in Bethlehem. In verse 7 of Matthew 8, we have Jesus express the, express the fact that if, that if need be, he will go and visit the centurion's servant and make him well. Implied in that is the fact that Jesus will have to enter the centurion's home. A centurion was not only a Gentile, but also a member of the occupying force in the promised land. Jesus was willing to tarnish his relationship to bring about the healing. You see, God is always willing to cross barriers to bring all his people to himself. So how did the early church incorporate the Gentiles? The answer is that we do not ultimately know. Remember that the book of Acts covers some 30 years of church history and just 28 chapters. It tells us something of the early church, but not very much. The Gentiles were incorporated in the early church, not because the church in Jerusalem mandated it. We know this happened this because central authority in no organization, in no place in time, has the ability to change local behavior in this way. What must have happened is that in numerous locales and numerous churches, Jewish Christians realized that in Christ, all people had the same standing. You see, a number of people realize that if God crossed barriers 
to reach them, then they must cross barriers to accept those whom God accepted. It is no different in the church today. We must cross barriers to accept those that God has accepted. The church can never remain in its own social and ethnic enclave. The church must always be reaching beyond itself. The church is only the church as it is crossing barriers like its master did before it.